Hey Jeff, thanks for inviting us here for yeah. dancing your photography. Yeah, anytime. So tell me about your approach to photography and the type of work you really love to do. I like to do all sorts of different types of work. I shoot travel and um, sports, climbing, surfing, and I like mo more of a photojournalistic style to things and kind of like to be a fly on the wall. And my favorite is lifestyle and portrait portraiture. What have been some of your biggest challenges that you've had to overcome as a photographer? Yeah, I, you know, I think it's uh, on a day-to-day -day basis, it's the elements that's challenging, um, especially if you're working with natural light. I don't work with any kind of uh, lights or flashes or anything, so I'm really dependent on um, the environment. So the biggest challenge for me, which would get, that can get tough on trips, is uh, the elements not working with you. How about composition? Have you developed any kind of sort of approach that you find works? Yeah, I think it's just uh, really basic, just um, simplicity. You know, you want your photographs, or at least I want mine. It doesn't always work this way, but to be really simple. I think the best photographs is where you don't, you, the last thought when you're looking at the photograph is the photographer. It's not something people are thinking of, like, how did you get that shot? Or it's like they're not even, they're looking at that photo and they're in it and they're not even, yeah. They're not even thinking about a photographer. So Jeff, we were talking about your kit. Tell me what's in your kit. For climbing and lifestyle and just kind of basic everyday shooting, this is my go-to camera. This is a Canon 5D. Um, zoom lenses. Most of the time when I'm climbing up on a wall, it's just easier. Um, for surf and any kind of action, I always use the Mark IV, Canon Mark IV. Super fast camera. Shoot usually with a fixed 85 or a wide angle. I still shoot film quite a bit, and when I do, I use my Leica M7 with a fixed 50. Um, I used to have a wide angle lens, but I figured uh, most of the time I just go with the 50 and it does the job. That's kind of my uh, travel kind of street photography camera. And this is my little travel companion, my Leica D3 point and shoot. This I usually have in my pocket and just pop off frames here and there. Hey Jeff, thanks for joining us. Yeah, thank you Mark, I appreciate it. You bet. Appreciate your time. Be sure to subscribe to our blog now to stay updated on my show. And we'll give you tips and insight to keep advancing your photography. Also check out our guests' website for a closer look at their work. Tune into our next episode of Advancing Your Photography for an inside look at another photographer's world. Until then, this is Mark Silber reminding you to get out and capture your own images of life.